again, day two. What's up guys, how's it going Mark from 408? We're back down the track and we're a little more prepared today. We got Jordan again, what's up, how are you? You feeling better today? Feeling much better today. <laughs> Hopefully we don't break as much stuff. So I uh, grabbed the key for this thing. We're gonna try and start it once more. And then if that doesn't work, we're draining the oil of this thing. Well, first we're gonna rip the doors off it. Then we're gonna drain the oil and we're gonna fill it full of, what did we get, silicone? silicone so we'll see how that works we got the hulkman 10.0 here and uh, my gopro so i don't know what to do here i'll give you that and i'll grab a key here how many keys do i got got the dodge key got the old toyota key here she good to go <laughs> I really don't think this thing's gonna start. I mean, it didn't last time, but you never know. Maybe it just needed to ma marinate for a little bit. So you gotta hold down both buttons. And then it should say 100 and ready. Yep. Beauty. All right, we got noise. We got some broken glass there. That's always good. Hopefully there's no snakes or raccoons living in here. Yeah, this thing is pretty much done. I'm wondering if the shifter is stuck and it's not allowing it to. Uh... Any other ideas? Try neutral. It won't even shift. Start neutral. Yeah, it won't shift at all. Give me a minute here. Look what I just found. Three more of these bad boys. There was five last time I found them. They're all jammed in here. There's probably more in here somewhere. And then, yeah, three more were under the seat. We got eight free coffees. Definitely worth it buying this car. All right, I gave this a quick love tap. Put her in neutral. Yeah, this thing's got nothing. Try all gears. What is on the camera lens? I think we're just gonna have to do the old yeah, fajord there. I don't think this thing's going. No, she's headed to the scrapyard. All right, let's get the Ford. Hopefully this thing doesn't run out of gas today. She's been running on yeah, empty. empty <laughs> it's been running on empty for a month. Hawkman, good to go. Come on, girl. Yeah, that's how much gas we've had for the last month. Clean some of that water out there. All right, now you can slam the hood down. <laughs> oh, man. Got a lamp out. We got the handy dandy old Yankum rope. We haven't used it in a bit, so I figured bring her out, test her out. So we're gonna drag this thing out into public there. And then, uh, might as well rip a door or two off it. I was gonna just back the Dodge up 1,000 miles an hour and rip the door off, but I'm thinking, let's hook the Yakim up to the door and try and rip it off. That should be fun, eh? All right, hopefully we don't run out of gas.
that was epic. I don't know. Was it epic? I couldn't see. Yeah, it was pretty good. <laughs> oh, I think it threw itself in park or something because it's not as ragged as good as it thought. And then, yeah, she gave me a good love tap there. Oh, might have to redo this jump now. Whoops. Ah, she's good. Knocked the weeds off. Uh, should we check the damage on the Ford? Oh yeah, she's good. It's beautiful. Oh man, we have caved in the back pretty good. Look at this fold. <laughs> so, I could kind of see it, but most, I couldn't really see much. And it, you know, it looks like it kind of cleared it the second time, but the first time it smashed pretty hard. So, we'll have to take a good look at the game tape here. But, you know, I was not expecting today to go like this. And uh, it's turned out really well. So that's how well the Yankum rope works. You can drag, you can jump a, a ghost forward behind the Dodge, no problem. And yeah, it just freaking. The only thing that kind of hurt, well, it didn't really hurt, but when this ran into me. But other than that, like the the full stretch, I didn't even feel it. Honestly, I didn't even know the car was there. So, all right, should we yank this around and uh, blow up the engine? Why not? I want to see this video too. <laughs> Let's do it. Well, we had to walk back and grab the Hulkman. We forgot it when I got the little love tap there. This thing shut off, so. All right, let's drag her back. Did some damage here. I still think we should be test pilots for Ford or any car company. Absolutely. Like we can show you the safety standards of all our vehicles. Anyways, the Yankum got that wedged in there after that all that carnage. So basically, we just unhooked it, drove away, she popped right out. So look at that muffler. Oh my god. So we're gonna tip it up, drain the oil out, and uh, we're gonna fill her fill us fill her full of silicone. See how she goes. Pan now. So as you can see there's where it snapped off the hub there. This side seems to be good. He's a unipeeler now. Well it doesn't even work at all so we'll drain the oil out and then uh, fill her full of silicone. Oh yeah let her drain. Anyone need some oil for sale? Five bucks. And we got our PL premium in exchange for the SAE 5W20. Hopefully we can get in there. I don't know how we're gonna do this. You wanna push with the crowbar? This might take a few hands. Hopefully it doesn't poke through it. <laughs> She's slowly coming out. <laughs> That's as much as it came out. All right, give us a minute. Mr. Muscle's over here. <laughs> I thought we could leverage it with a crowbar, but she's coming out. It's coming out. Oh, yeah. Maybe a quarter Got away. Half a tube in there. Best six bucks we ever spent. Got your workout for the day. Pipes. How's she looking? Oh, yeah. It's almost good to go. Can we get any more in there? Is that tube done? No, it's still uh, probably a quarter left. All right, let's fill her up. I should have filmed that, but we did half a crank there and that sucked her right in there. So we're gonna do the rest of that bottle. Now it's go time. What'd you say, 215? It's gonna last? 215 is my guess. 215, I'm gonna guess 110. All right, second bottle. Now we're gonna need a PL sponsor for all the car cocking we do. Come on. Yeah, get her in there. Oh yeah. 
So our second bottle is uh, the 300 model. She's a little thicker. So do a little half turn there, let her suck in. Once more. And once more. Let's get the rest of that bottle in there and fire it up. Down the hatch. It's bet time. 110, 215. So as soon as I start it, then uh, I'll start the timer. Leave your guesses down in the comments. Yeah. All right. Go time. cocked up inside. Let's grab the booster, throw it back on, see if we can start it once more. booster pack put it on there too I don't know. Oh, apparently was that um, my only other thing is maybe when we jumped the car the fuel shutoff switch I uh, got smacked but I don't think it would have ran that long with the fuel turned off so oh 
that is some smell, I'll tell you what. All right, let's throw the other booster pack on there, see if we can get some juice. In there. seem to like us today. I mean, I wouldn't like us either after we just put it through. We cannot find the inertia switch on this thing. We watch a few YouTube videos and cannot find it. I'm usually a pro at finding them on the Fords. I'd say this thing's cooked. Or out of fuel. <laughs> I need to try and YouTube one more video, see if we can find the inertia switch, and if not, we'll end the video. We did a quick gas run. <laughs> can we even get fuel in there? Oh man. Let's throw a few liters in and see if we can get her going here. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Come on, Betsy. We just keep running out of gas. I'll put a bit more gas in her and see if it's pretty long to go. I figured she'd be seized up now. Come on, girl.
one booster pack's dead. We'll throw in the other one once more. And if it doesn't die, well, I'm pretty much over it. The Ford wins. <laughs> Come on. for our booster packs to charge so we've decided to drive a ball into the uh the old echo see if it makes an echo holy crap oh that could have been bad right off the rim oh good thing you hit it at an angle that would have sucked if it came back and hit us where went uh, you hit somewhere off this rim i think it was right there did you see it fly? No. Like it, it landed over by the river. Like completely gone. And you took a big chunk out of it because it made the weirdest noise when it took off. That's hilarious. <sighs> well, we're waiting for our booster packs to charge. So we've decided to drive a ball into the, uh, the old Echo. See if it makes an Echo. Holy crap. Oh, that could have been bad. Right off the rim. Oh, good thing you hit it at an angle. That would have sucked if it came back and hit us. Where went? Uh, you hit somewhere off this rim. I think it was right there. Did you see it fly? No. Like it, it landed over by the river. Like completely gone. And you took a big chunk out of it because it made the weirdest noise when it took off. That's hilarious. Oh. All right, I'm going to stand back a little further this time. Hopefully it hits the window or something. Hopefully this thing seizes up. A lot of hopefullys, but we'll see. Oh, <laughs> off the ground. She gone. Round three. <laughs> nice. Is that everything you ever wanted? <laughs> Absolutely. All right, let's get this thing going again. Okay, one more. Swing and a miss. Last time, then we're out of here. Everything's just cooked on this thing. I gotta try one more thing, and then we're done. All right, we're 
down, screw it. This thing, she didn't seize, but there's no life left in her. So I guess the PL Premium, uh, I don't know, it works, but it didn't, it didn't work the way we wanted it to. So unless this engine's so clapped out that it's just basically, there's so much room to play in there. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Have a fantastic day. We're glad we could tow this thing around and be idiots and have all the fun stuff. Check out the links below, pick up some Freeman merch, and uh, we'll see you later. Bye-bye.